Welcome back to my messy room. What's up? Okay, um, okay, the lighting is terrible right now. Let's fix that. I feel like the lighting is kind of awkward like this. Maybe it's okay. I might really regret this later. But, okay, I need some kind of update because it's just been a crazy few months. So, it's officially December now, which is exciting. Okay, this lighting, <laughs> I feel like I'm totally like overexposed, but I've been working on my room a lot. That's kind of like my creative outlet. Basically, that's how I procrastinate to do my homework now. But I mean, you can already see how this is different. I really need to clean my room because I want to clean my room. I kind of want to show you some of the new things in my room. Of course, I'm still adding to it. I'm always still adding to my room. I'm asking for a lot of like room decor. Like basically all I want for Christmas is like stuff for my room. So um, hopefully after Christmas, like I'll try to do a, a what I got for Christmas. But then also after Christmas, I'll do like a redecorating my room. And stuff like that. Prepare yourself for a quick sock haul. These are all from the Old Navy, so yeah. And they're all doggy ones, because I love dogs. These ones, they like happy holidays, and I've been loving green. Green is like my favorite color now, but also these are so cute. I think these are my favorite of the dogs. And then some little corgis. Then we got penguin, Christmas light, little wiener dogs, and snowmen. I also have like nutcracker ones, and I have another pair of light ones, but instead it's like black and with strings of light on them. But yeah, I got them like in a set. That's why there's so many socks. But I have a sock addiction. I love socks. Like all my friends, they got me socks for my, for my birthday because they just know. That was really random. But I mean, it's the day before Christmas, so... Gotta be at least a little first. I guess I can start with this, what's behind me. If you've seen my other videos, you would know that my Alex the Nine drawers were always on the other side of my room by my dresser. But right before Thanksgiving, right before guests were coming in town stuff, I kind of like freaked out for some reason. And I started like rearranging a couple of things. So I moved this all the way over here and I moved my clothing rack, which I'll show you. I moved my clothing rack where my Alex Nine drawers are, and so now it's over here. And then, so I moved the stool here and I kind of made this like little setup with the picture frame and this old Polaroid camera that I found at an antique shop. And there's some fake flowers there in a cat jar. And then I just got these lights from Ikea. They're so cool. It comes all in one thingamabob with all these different strands and I love stars so much so when I saw them I just had to get them because I just have an addiction to stars. So that's this side. So here's how my dresser is looking. I made this inspiration board myself. It's kind of covered up because of my sunflower. I also drew this sunflower and I just have it here right now for some reason. And then I probably need to get rid of this pumpkin because it's December now and it's probably rotten. Like I think it's squishy now. Oh well. But um, so I have my records here right now and I'm hoping to get a new record player for Christmas so I can listen to it. But yeah, this is my Rex Orange County one. Um, it's my favorite. Like I love having it on display because I love seeing it every day. Then over here, so I have this mirror. I've had this frame, a little gold one since last Christmas. My sister gave it to me. It's just from Target. I put a page from a book inside actually, which I got from art class last year because she let me keep it because <laughs> we were doing blackout poetry and I just liked the pictures in this book. So I like kept some of the pages. I have a new candle. It smells really good. And I have a little plant waterer, which I see these like on Urban Outfitters now. They're very snazzy. But I just got this one from the dollar section in Target and I love it. It goes with my room so well. Oh, I was talking about the mirror, but I got sidetracked. Um, this is just a random old mirror and I've talked about the project above my bed before with the collage of frames and I actually filmed a whole video about it, but I never edited it or posted it or anything. I don't know if I'm going to or not maybe i did and it's already up 
by now. I doubt I will because I'm about to show you the final product of my collage in a second. But this was a frame. This was a mirror that didn't really go with the other frames. So I ended up putting it here for a second, like before I hung it up because I needed a place to put the frames. And I actually fell in love with it being here. And I'm so glad that I put it over here with this stuff. And then here we have this little marble tray which is actually so gorgeous i got it from tuesday morning and it was pretty inexpensive like it is so beautiful like it it has like a little shimmer to it or something it's really hard to see right now um probably because of this lighting because of the lamp it's making it look yellow or something so i just like keep my small candles on here and i'm actually so glad i got this because it is so much more pleasing to the eye because it looks so much less cluttered when I have it there. But like I still wanted that kind of cluttered look with all the knickknacks and stuff and like all the candles. But this just makes it look a little cleaner. And then I have this lamp which is just my brother's and I took it from him because he didn't want it. I just like the look of like the exposed light bulb. It's not going to show on camera but it kind of has the little swirliness to it where you can see the light bulb. Like I don't know how to explain this but... I think you get what I mean. It's normally what you see in an exposed kind of light bulb lamp thing. Because, you know, light bulb's gotta look cute. But yeah. Then we have my usual, my favorite poetry corner. But here we go. Here's the collage I've been talking about. So I decided not to put it over my bed and I put it up here. And so since I'm most likely not gonna post the other video, I'll like kind of go through what's on here. So here is a print I got from Society6. I have a little heart frame, which is just from an antique store. I have this little frame and I natural colors of yarn. And like some of them have like gold sequins in it, or like gold glitter. And I wrapped that around the glass in the frame. That was from an antique store too. I got it at the same time as the heart, I think. This little guy um, I found in my basement. It was like my grandmother's. The one up here, I painted myself, which I showed in the video but i actually think i'm gonna replace it because i think the contrast is too much for me like i think i would like something that kind of blends in with the theme of my room better just to make it look more monochrome because i just really like having like those few colors present in my room and that's it i try to stick to my room to any shade of pink any shade of yellow white and gold and i also like wood but i don't really have like any natural wood in here um just because i have the furniture that i had previously which is my sister's furniture and then the last one at the top I got from an antique store and it just came like that. It came with the flowers and I kept it in there. And I used to have the smiley face up, but I thought it looked a little too like kiddish and like homemade because I was like making a lot of things for the wall. So I ended up taking that down. For this one, I ordered a print on Urban Outfitters. It's like a floral, this little flower design. It's so pretty and it's got more of those neutral colors and like almost orangish. I don't know, just got those warmer tones that will go amazing with my room. So I'm really pumped about that. Okay, this has been bothering me. There we go, now it's straight. I need to put these paintbrushes away. So I put my mirror that was over here on my Alex 9 drawers. So now over here, I actually like it a lot better over here. I thought I was just gonna, I thought I was gonna hate it more because of taking away that mirror because I love that mirror so much. But I just have, I have like a couple plants over here now. This really dead plant. The other plant holder I'm using as a pen holder and they're actually cute pens. So it goes to my room and it's all cute. And then I put my makeup caddy thingy in here and I actually love how I put that cat in there because I love that cat because my dad got it for me. But I had it over here before and I feel like it just didn't, it just didn't go with the theme well enough. So yeah, everything's the same except for I just put all my pusheens down here. You can't see all, all of them right now, but I love that fuzzy pusheen. So yeah. And then I have lights up here. They're not on right now, so it probably looks really crappy. But I mean, you kind of get the gist. So I have two new lights from Ikea. One of them is from Urban Outfitters because my friend got it for me for my birthday. And it's like these stars that hang down. But honestly, Urban Outfitters designed them terribly because they won't stay in place so i had to put command hooks up there for it not to shift around because the lengths of the string would start to get uneven but i just got these two new ikea ones 
So I feel like um, I need to fix this somehow. One of the things I asked for for Christmas was like a tapestry or something. So I'm thinking maybe I could just put that under there and it would look a little better. I'm gonna turn it on so you can see this. And um, another quick thing, I still have this table in here. I just don't have anywhere to put it right now. Well, because I'm taking it out of my room um, because it wasn't even mine, it was my sister's, but it's just stuck here right now. Probably until I update my room with more room decor. That's probably when I'll move it out of here. Let me turn on the lights for y'all. Okay, so in this clip I was saying I was going to show the lights, but I guess my camera shut off or something, but you'll see that in a second because in the other clips it's going to show it, but that's why there's just like this interruption before it shows it because it's a different day. And there's different stuff going on, but I eventually show it in that clip. So. So, um, I didn't think I was going to decorate for Christmas because my room just does not fit a Christmas theme. It's all pink and just like adding red or green would be weird. So I wasn't gonna decorate. But then I just found a box of my Christmas decorations from last year and so now I'm starting to use those and I'm trying to make it work. So I had a Christmas tree last year. It was a real Christmas tree, but it's just really small. And so I have all this stuff for that, but I don't have a tree now. Like I need to get a fake tree, but I don't think that's gonna happen. Now I have these ornaments and like that's really what I have for decorations. So I'm working with that. So here's what I've put up. I put up my snowflake um, string lights, which I had last year, and then, don't worry, it's not done, but I started putting up the ornaments, like, kind of as a garland. I'm really proud of myself for this idea. Here's what I currently have. I just have, like, four up, but they're all different. And so I have, like, this stuff, and I'm gonna just, like, continue putting some of them up. I'm just, like, using the string it came with to tie it on. Look, I have this really cute tree skirt. For a mini tree and it goes so well with my room but i don't have a tree like i wish there was something else i could use this for because it's just so cute but like this is kind of a random thing that looks stupid doesn't it you know what i'm gonna deal with that in a minute these string lights look so much brighter but they're actually not as bright as they look so it goes a lot better with the ornaments Maybe if I do like a close-up, you'll be able to see a little better. Okay, so that is now up. I went to Ikea today, and so I have some things to show for that. It's more room decor, of course, because I love decorating my room and shopping for my room. So one of the things is already set up. I built it before filming this, so I'll show that. These two string lights, these stars, and the ones that... Are with the stars they're both from ikea and they came in sets kind of like this but these lights the ones that were in this box are right here they're like a whole curtain almost of of lights so you can fill a whole wall so at ikea i got this plant stand and i just built it today I got all these plants at lowe's and i got this pot from urban outfitters these two pots as a gift and this one came in this pot from Lowe's. So the other thing I got from Ikea was like a light and so I need to put that up right now. Okay, it's so cute. Oh my gosh. Okay. Does it come with a light bulb? Okay, so here's the little clampy thing. Oh, it comes with a light bulb. That's nice. cord is so cute. Okay, it's time to plug it in. <gasps> I did it. So I can just have that as a reading light. Perfect. Okay, I need to like clean up and make my bed so that I can make this look a little better. Okay, so I changed into my pajamas and I just kind of straightened up my bed a little. It's still not perfect. My room is still a mess, but I thought I'd show you like at least this update so you can get a little bit over a picture. Here you go. So here is the file. I really need to paint my room because if you move the camera down a little bit, you get this. Or just, but yes. And here's this one, which definitely needs some work, but I've done enough for one day. Obviously that stool is not gonna be there forever. That's just a temporary thing for now. So I'd just like to make that clear. 
because I know that does look weird, especially right now, but I really love the plants. Okay, so I never really gave an update. I ended up putting the snowflake ones on the clothing rack. And then the lights are off now, but the lights are just up there without the snowflakes. And I cleaned up my nightstand. Welcome back to my messy room. Well, wasn't that just so much fun? My my memory card just ran out of storage and then I found out that all my other memory cards were also full. So I cleared some things off of this one and I'm back. Like just as I was about to start talking, it shut off. But I'm continuing my room decor because I have an obsession with room decor. And um, yeah, some things came in the mail from Urban Outfitters, which I ordered, which apparently my mom had in the closet because she thought it was like Christmas gifts or something. Anyways, so I'm gonna show you that. I just put in a new print in my frames, which I've shown that little corner, the little collage of thingamabobs. So I'm gonna show that first. You know, the lighting is not the best, but this like, this orangish one, that's the new one. I feel like now I need to like take this middle one and like put something else in it. This has finally like come together, I think. The next thing was more plant pots. So I already have this one, which you know, but I got these two, the one with the little googly eyes. Those came in and I'm still waiting on one more. It's a really small one and it's like a terracotta pot. It has like little like, like stars and like moons or something like that. As you can tell, I love stars. I have a thing for like stars and moons and like solar stuff, so. So this is how I set it up for now because like I just change it as I get more pots. It looks somewhat decent with what's there at the moment, but I'm waiting for that little pot and I'll try to put it next to that one up there. But we'll see. As you saw before, I have more plants than this. So right now the other plants are just chilling over here. These two, I could have like put one temporarily on there, but like they're too big, so. Um, I don't really know how I feel about this. When I look at it through the camera, it looks a lot better, I feel like. I need to put a Polaroid in the pink one. This might look extremely stupid. You're so cute. Okay. Okay, honestly, this will do for now. I kind of don't like how it just feels like it's all cramped to the very back, but I also want the feeling of like having open space on there. So maybe I should take some stuff off, but I think I'm just going to leave it like this for now. I, I actually think it's really cute. I'm living in the sweatshirt. Anyways, so I left out the rest of this clip because I thought I would save it for another video or something. Um, and also this video has already gotten to be so long. Basically, I'm closing it now, I guess. It is Christmas Eve. I'm really excited. And tomorrow I'm going to be doing a what I got for Christmas. So be excited for that. And... So I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you give this a like and subscribe down below. Happy holidays. Also, like, there are already, like, room updates right next to me and I want to show you, but I'm going to do an official video soon. Also, this is, like, super comfortable. I'm just going to live like this. This is how I'm spending my Christmas. Also, I would just like to mention I'm definitely wearing this tomorrow on Christmas, so you're not allowed to judge me because I'm warning you. So yeah, see you guys tomorrow.